Okay, I have an S mate. You're an S mate. I have an S mate. Nice. Uh, never mind. So it's time to I didn't really play Charizard uh, because Charizard before. I respect Smash Brown for going for the uh, color that no one ever goes for when it comes to S. Yeah. I can talk about, about the player side of things. Everyone knows that my uh, my character knowledge isn't always the highest. Um, yeah, I mean, you're definitely right. Obviously, that combo ability is quite good um, with, uh, obviously, uh, upon Charizard. Um, and obviously, Ness has got some lovely tools. Um, a lot of sparkles, yeah. Um, I think what, what, what Doom's very good at, though, he's very, very good at spacing. He's very, very good at zoning. Um, and, you know, his... That kind of like defensive aspect around, you know, the more offensive play is quite strong. Uh, the Smash Brown's definitely been working as well on just being able to um, try and keep himself one step ahead of the game. He's trying to definitely um, be a bit, be a bit, a bit, a bit, bit more creative, but you know, try and find tricks to get, you know, to just not not necessarily read everything, but you know, just have an answer for some things. But oh, the upbeat came out, but landing up air does land. Like my word. Catch with these uh, these big old wangs of his. Um, yeah, the armor there of the rock smash is kind of allowing him to land. I do like the um, you know the usage of oh crikey. Um, I do yeah. As I said the king of PK Thunder two in Luigi Mitsu. This is it is obviously is a Mitsu, but um, you know, he goes for them you know. Um, yeah, just have it nearer to your mouth. Yeah. There you go. Sorry about that, guys. But um. Yeah, sorry. What were you saying? Um, you were saying that um. Oh um. I don't know. I lost my train of thought. Okay, no worries, no worries. It's all good. <laughs> but um. Oh, not getting. You know, there was a lot of opportunity there for Smash Brown to get in, but obviously a lot of people, people tend to get out of PK th um, PK mm -hmm. Fire, but actually um, the Silent Doom getting caught. So what you have to do is like people don't really. Oh, very nice repair. People really don't. What you're supposed to do is you put the STI out in the way. But you're supposed to like kind of jiggle the controller a little bit more, and you can easily get out of it. So I know it can be kind of like difficult if you really are familiar with Ness speaking fire, but and the landing up I there mean, is obviously really good for Ness as well because there's just very little cooldown on the landing. Woo! Let's just get out of there. Let's just get the hell out oh. of dodge. Oh, not making that. Wow. That's a Looks like that was probably a miss input uh, going for the side B off stage. Probably wasn't intentional there by Doom. Yeah. Man. Mm. Smash Bound. There we go. I was going to say, it's losing all of my uh, information. There we go. Sorry. No, it's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm having to update the bracket. You're oh, doing up, up, multiple update jobs stream, at yeah. once, yeah. And the cloud comes out immediately. Oh, um, the cloud. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Uh, I can't blame him for that. It wasn't going too well for him. No, the, uh, it wasn't. It wasn't. Uh, this is definitely a rougher matchup for Ness too. I think also because of like there, you know, Ness has have the have the odd disjoint. Um, you know, with obviously with the. Uh, with the PK sparkles, you know, you know with the, the fair PK and stuff. Sparkles. But it's like having that extra bit of range of the sword might help him out just a little bit. Um, yeah, but yeah. it's it's all about whether you know Sandu can get into his comfort with Cloud. Yeah, I, you say it's just a pocket, right? So you're, he doesn't play him as often as it sounds like. Yeah. Yeah. So. 
Uh, definitely true. This is a really rough matchup because I was saying earlier that Ness is so small, um, and Cloud's sword is so freaking huge, so it just takes up so much, and Ness is forced to approach, and Ness is not really good at approaching, um, especially characters like Cloud. Yeah. Ooh, expending it really early. Yeah. And Doom's normally one who's very, very patient with it, with his limit. Yeah, that's definitely something uh, you really want to try and hold if you can. Yeah, Cloud's definitely uh, not a bad choice to switch, especially in terms of this matchup. Unless in general just struggles with uh, Swordsy. So anyone with Swords, uh, Corrin, is also really tough. And Marv can be really hard too, so... Yeah, that it's just tiny body is just too tiny. <laughs> <laughs> Characters with small profiles are... Oh, Ooh. the scoop! <laughs> And this is our projectiles aren't so like good at like getting in. It's not like fireballs. You have PK fire, but you, you know how special that is. So really careful. But he's definitely not doing a bad job here. Um, he's definitely keeping Doom out. Yeah. yeah. Um, especially with Cloud, you want to try and keep him off stage as possible, just because Cloud uh, does not do very well when he's off the stage. The back nice. throw, as we know, one of the one well, perhaps one of the strongest kill throws in the game right now, or throws, sorry, rather. Um, yes, yeah, it's very very strong. Um, I mean, at a much lower percentage still, that would have taken it at, at that in that positioning at least. Mm -hmm, yeah, uh, you definitely want to be very careful of getting back on a stage versus Ness, especially if you are at high percent, just because you do want to avoid that back throw. Mm. Oh, crikey! Getting that for that. Uh, that forward smash out. Oh! Okay. You know he was going for it there. <laughs> oh, oh, you know what? Maybe a, possibly a accidental B reverse. That sometimes happens with this. I know I've definitely done it before, so. so uh, a oh, little man. bit late in his in his own offense. L you know, getting punished with a landing up air from the tiny child. <laughs> There's also really dangerous kids in this game. Villager, <laughs> you know, he's like a Villager, fort. Villager, the, mur the murder child. Like the guy can wall jump. <laughs> the guy's got a mortgage and he can wall jump. I mean, <laughs> there we go. Very, very nice good. two stock very from good. Silent Doom. Yeah, he's a mortgage and wall jump. That's funny. Whoa. It's nuts. <laughs> very true. He's out here building homes and trees and stuff. He's yeah, he's a woodsman. <laughs> he's a woodsman. Oh, I've seen the uh, the Mercy Kong, the Mercy oh, so you've Kong. I've seen the Donkey Kong before. It's Fun? Scary? Quite scary. SP's uh, DK. So oh, sorry. I thought I thought you said it was. I was like, oh, I don't know. I, I've seen a video of him playing at home mm -hmm. with with his Donkey Kong, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, the character, the character, the character's got some nice stuff. Um. But uh, I haven't seen I haven't seen Smash Brown bring it out in tournament before, so the double back air, yeah. triple back air. Well, especially on stage, you, uh, getting that grab too. Don't forget to grab <laughs> to up throw up, up, just like that. Yeah, um, Donkey Kong was definitely probably a character um, that. I feel like it's, it works out both ways. You know, Cloud can kind of juggle DK, but DK is also really good at, good at keeping Cloud out, especially with those back airs we were seeing earlier. Yeah. Very nice. Oh! That was actually really smart there. Um, landing just a little bit, um, allowing SB to jump and then having enough air to cover it. Yeah. The strength of that back air showing itself and taking that stock off of Silent Doom. He seemed quite safe, but you know he didn't get to use that limit. Was that sorry? There was a, a cross slash for 19 percent. Was that a double jab for 21? <laughs> or was there a hit before that I just what? missed? I think I, I want to say there was a hit before that. 11, 12, 12 from you know the uh, the up throw to double back air. Ooh. Oh! Maybe that smash was exactly the safest option to do. No, obviously wasn't. <laughs> Destroyed. That, you know, the uh, Donkey Kong punch there. Yeah, that was a really nice punish here by SP. Oh. 
Yeah. Our range peaked. Yeah. Very good there by two. Ooh! Wow. Butterfly with a best DI. A little bit yeah. painful, but uh, very good for Doom. Um, making sure that he does not allow SB to land at all. You know, Klaus is really good at doing next to that huge sword he has. Man, look at that strength, 67%. Yeah, going from 0 to 67 in less than 5 seconds. That's just what you can do. That's just the ability that Cloud has with with, with, with his moveset. Exactly. He has those tools. Oh, is he? <gasps> Ooh! <laughs> Putting the finishing touches on that game. 2-1 <laughs> okay. over to Silent Doom. Exactly. The finishing touch. The pocket cloud being a good pick. Yeah, that was it a very seems. solid pick there by Doom. I mean, honestly, having a pocket cloud is never a bad choice. <laughs> Uh, Cloud's not, he's not hard to learn, he's a really simple pickup, and he's good. Hmm? Okay. Are there any afterwards, or are these the last games? If you want to do it, you got to get some content out, Mr. Jeeps. G tilde P. That is important. <laughs>